We told you in the course of this newscast how for more than 48 hours now, the Divisional Officer for Batibo Subdivision in the Northwest region of Cameroon is what about is still unknown. A security channel as well as administrative authorities and multiplying efforts to uncover its whereabouts and guest tonight is an opposition leader, the president of the party political party, Mr. Jean de Diomomo, we are equally a barrister at law. Good evening to you. Thank you so much for joining us tonight on Talking Point. Good evening, uh, Mimi Mefo. Good evening, uh, televiewers. And uh, good evening of uh, our bro brothers and sisters of Southwest and Northwest. Thank you so much. The unknown armed individuals picked up the divisional officer for Batibo that we have been talking about since the 11th of February and for over two days now. His whereabouts is unknown. This is the first time that a civil administrator is captured, and for several hours now, we don't yet know where he is or who took him away. How can you explain the target of the attackers whose identity up to now remains unknown? Uh, we have to understand the signification of uh, uh, this matter. If the attackers uh, target the officials, you know, that means we are really involved in the war in Northwest and Southwest. It's, it's, it's not an easy matter to plan the, uh, the arrestation of somebody like that, to plan and catch somebody who is command the gendarmes and military, you know, they have to be a good organization. And this means that uh, it is not a simple matter because it looks like the answer of the attackers to the government arrestation of the leaders and government leaders in Nigeria. It just looks like the answer. So that means they don't want to dialogue anymore. Here is the point of no return that I was afraid for. Because if somebody can remember, I told people on this TV and the other TV that this matter has to be taken very carefully. Not like before, we just treat many, many, many things by force. This need to be very well understanding that they are claiming for something. A part of this country are claiming for something. And those, that part of the, the country is ready for the sacrifice of themselves. So when it happened, when you have to deal with somebody who has no, no choice than to die, who is not afraid to die, be ready yourself if you, are, you can die. So the, the people, the officials that are in the office, now they have understood that they are not in security in the, in the, in the home. Whereas uh, the government has made Cameroonians and the international community to understand the authorities as well as security forces that are equally being targeted because yesterday we had confirmed information from the defense ministry that three gendarme officials were killed, yes. brutally murdered in Kembong, in my new division of the southwest region of yeah. Cameroon. Whereas the government has made Cameroonians to understand that the security forces as well as local administrative authorities are there to secure the people. Yeah. So how can you explain the current twist of events? You know, to secure the people against other people because this is a, a war a civil war really because you don't know who is the enemy and the enemy look like you and me the adversary the one who are you are fighting with is look it is a Cambodian like you how can you distinguish the good and the bad that's why i say at the beginning let's go on the table and discuss about the change of the state let let's sit down like we did in 1991 uh, of what, what the so-called tripartite. So what is going on is you have a, the, the, a, a part of the population who are, uh, who, do, who are not in the war, but they pay the big price. They are running uh, through Nigeria to, to escape. But you have another party who are involved in the one who say we have to defend our motherland and they are ready to die so be if you have declared war with uh, between you and those people be ready to fight the war and we understood that if we don't put a dialogue we, we don't say even in the war 
the, are you, saying, what the are you saying, security, are you saying security forces deployed in the Anglophone regions are not for peace mission? No, 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 no. It's not sure that. Okay, the, the official mission is for peace mission. But for peace mission means you have to fight people against uh, the, the other, the civilian. How can you distinguish the civilian? And what is the problem there? The problem there is not starting now. Before they, they started killing the gendarmes, who was killing who? The forces, the, the police, the, the force that was supposed to secure the population start killing the people. The reaction is, I told them that time, the reaction should be that the population will defend themselves. If I was, we started by torturing the people, if you go there, uh, you, you are uh, for civil servant. When I say this, this is my truth. People cannot be, people will be against me because I said it. But you have to look the past. You have to say the truth when it starts like this, when it comes to, to the civil war. We have to, to, to watch the truth, to say the truth, and to say the, the, what it what is to say. Because if you don't say to them that you starting, it was just a demonstration, pacific demonstration, you started torturing people. When it comes to violent demonstration, you start killing the people. Now you start killing yourself, the people, and you expect that the people will not kill the, the gendarmes? You expect really that the people will not hide themselves and take the revenge? So, so, so TV, we don't so want that. that. So, so Ms. Barista, the, 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 another curiosity mm -hmm. is a day that it took place on the 11th of February. We saw how the was heavy military presence in the two Anglophone regions of Cameroon, yeah. especially on the ceremonial ground. Why would it take place on such a day yeah. when there is uh, reinforcement of security almost all over? Yes. What does it mean? That means they don't fear nobody and nothing. And this is the sign of the great determination of what we have in front of us, of who we have in front of us, on who the Cameroonian military have in front you have in front people who are ready to die and who attacks when they see you think that the security measure is there and who attack the chief and catch him and we don't know the whereabouts people say maybe he has been killed but we don't know we have not the official version like you said earlier, you had indicated before, mm -hmm. and even on October 2017, yeah. that uh, you were very concerned about the prevailing situation in the two Anglophone regions yeah. of Cameroon, and that in the long run, if nothing is done, it could escalate to something else. I say it, yes, it's true. It, remember it's what I say, it's true. It's going to, to, work, to it, it become worse and worse days and days. And I say it, please. Sit down. It's nothing very, very criminal to sit down with your people. And I remember what I said that time. I said, do you, you, Mr. President, do you have your power from the people? If it is so, sit down with those people who elected you and discuss. Because you are a mandatory. If you have a mandate, if you are represented with the people, sit down with the people and the people want to change the form of the government, you are not the only concern. It is not your, your country. It is our country. We are concerned about the form of the state. You cannot just say, I'm the head of state and I, I am refusing to discuss about the, 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 the form of the state. If we notice that the centralization during 60 years didn't bring us to the development, and if the people think that maybe federalism could change something in the daily life, in the comfort, in the way that the, 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 the Cameroon should grow up, sit down with us. Or if you are a foreigner, you don't have your power through us, through the, power, the, the people. Okay, send the army and fight them. You, and what is they do? You equally noted that the problem is because a majority of Cameroonians today do not really have a clue of what is happening because if they understood the stakes and what the Anglophone population actually want, the situation will be different. Now you're talking about dialogue. Can it be possible when 
uh, you say that several people are not really understanding the stakes of what is happening. What they don't understood because nobody explained to them. Explain to them that federalism don't mean secession, separation. They think that if you put you, you, you the form the state comes to the federalism, it is like uh, you are preparing the division, the separation of the state into two parts. This is false. This is not true. And we have to, to explain this to the people. And even those people with the, uh, of, the, of the government, uh, they have to explain what is the truth to the people. And what is the truth? It is this. The, the, the actual form of the state is the centralization to one singular person, a head of state who appears like a god, who give and remove when he wants. And the and, uh, anglophone people want a federalism, which means give our own part. At the beginning of the year, everyone has his own budget. Everyone has his own money to deal with his own people, to deal with his own government. To build his state, to build his school, his, his health care of his population. Of the nation. Yeah, you, you don't put in the same pocket to give to a, a single one. This is admissible. This is very admissible that if we put our money in the only single pocket, the pocket of Colombia, nobody eat it. They finish the money in Yaoundé. Divide into many, many states so, so that. We can, we people of down, of, of <laughs> the poor people, we could the masses, have, the masses of people, we could have a little bit part of it. This is what we are fighting for. And those people of Yaoundé, they don't want to hear about it. Because for 60 years, they have eat our common money, we don't see anything down. And now we started asking, it's, it's give our part. This simply, is the simplest simply problem. the form of government that needs to be changed, Barista. Now, Barista, the situation, like you said, is escalating and getting worse in the two Anglophone regions of Cameroon. It, what is the way forward? What is the solution? I'm afraid that now... Because you, you gave the impression that dialogue for dialogue to, it, to take place now is too late. Yes, I'm afraid. I'm afraid that now we have the radicalization of the part that was able to sit down and uh, discuss. We attend the summit of the radicalization that those people who, who kidnapped the DO are ready to die for what they think it is the duty. The duty is to die for the country. So, how could you discuss with somebody who is ready to die? Look, the Arabs, when they put the bombs and go to explode, that one, you that's, cannot, that's, you cannot say, you kill yourself. Do. You cannot, he, he, somebody who is ready to kill himself, who is ready to die. How could you discuss with somebody? So, so what, what is the way forward, Barista, if you were to give some proposals or solutions? The solution the is that Mr. Paul Biya came down. Because he is the master that we have built, or the monster, some of the can call like this. But he is the master of the situation. Calm down and speak to your people. Not the way that you characterize them as a terrorism and separatism. The separatism, the separatists are not a forcibly a terrorist. A terrorist is different of the separatists. When I remember 1958 to 1960, and uh, before the independence, the people of UPC was calling terrorism, the Makiza. So later on, they recognized them as a national hero. Heroes. So please, remember the past, where we are discussing for our country. Remember that tomorrow you will recognize that those people who are in the truth, who tell you that you are in the truth? You are not God. Nobody is God, but we can see that there's a problem facing by Anglophone region and many other regions as well. But the Anglophones are the ones who are fighting for. Many Francophones, including people from Cam, from Bam, from Bamileke, they are suffering from North. They are suffering. They are, they are 
sending the memorandum to Paul Bia to say, please give us this, give us this. We don't want a God in power. We don't want that God replace human being in power. That the president become the God that we will show, we will come to beg to beg. The system, uh, anglophone system of NRA rule is different because in the NRA rule it is not a a president who is this, the, giving every God. It is the parliament who decides everything. You have the same system in South Africa. Look what is happened in South Africa. The, the, yes, they are ready to stay down the president because the parliament represents the whole country. And the parliament is the one who decides. You know why the centralization is bad? Because the centralization has been introduced by the colonizer to have a single person that they can catch him and say, sell all this, sell your country, give us this, give us that. But it, this, this, the NRA rule doesn't tell me that. The NRA rule, it, the president cannot decide himself. It's only the parliament. Or to corrupt 280 parliamentary, it's, it's, parliamentarians. It, parliamentarians. It's, it's not easy as to to corrupt a single person, you know. Of course. Yes. Now, now, Barista, you were talking about leadership in Cameroon, and we are just a few weeks to the senatorial elections. Uh, would Padek be taking part? How will we take part when the electoral corp is not ready? The, the electoral corp calls of, of a, a, to, to elect the senator, a municipal councillor, and regional councillor. Where are the regional councillors? Do we have? We have municipal councillor, but we don't have regional councillor because we have not organized it. How can you organize the senatorial without when the electoral core is not constituted? This is absolutely illegal and dictatorial. So, how can we go? Even we go, we cannot win. It's just you are, that you are aware well already that if you go, you not win because who, have, we can have, win have, without have, without. It has very few councils. It's very few council. We were waiting to organize municipal council, a regional council now, to gain many place, to gain many mayors and many regionals, and after all, after you can organize the senate, but during what they say, what what, what they plan. It's just a plan to to be sure that only the CPTM will have senators. Even the SDF, who is trying to go, I'm not sure the SDF will get some something. How many? How the many? SDF already has 14 senators. In yes, Europe. but do you know that it was with the help of the CPTM. It's, it's, not, it's not verified, Barista. It's not hey, verified. no. How, how can we say that in the north, the the CPTM give the, the instruction? And in the in the noon, the noon, you remember that the CPD give the instruction to his people to 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 elect the the the, the SDF. And do do you remember that they disqualified a list of the CPD? Yes, there were lists that were disqualified because they did not meet up to the expectations. I'm, I'm not too much sure. <laughs> that is that is mere speculation, Barista. I'm not too much sure. And uh, what? How is your view of the electoral year now? Looking at the situation. In Cameroon, the, so the social, economic, and political situation in Cameroon now. The situation is really bad, but people are against the government. But nobody wants to register for vote. Nobody trusts in our system of voting. Nobody trusts Elecap. You do everything to register people. You come empty hand. We do everything. We even put. Uh, uh, like a um, game that you will win something if you you go to to register you don't get nobody outside all those young people are angry with the regime they want the regime to be changed but no one trusts that we can change through the election so what according to science, political science what way remain to, to, to those people. The, 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 the revolution or the access to the power by a revolution, that is by a way who is not liquid. Or just to register and vote. Barista. They don't want to register and vote. 
and I told them this is the good way to register, go we register and get the right to demonstrate. Because when you register, you put them together, you have the right to demonstrate, to say they have you not count my vote. You have to protect your vote. You have to sit down and say, let's count together. But they don't want to understand me. I say I'm tired to say to the people, go and register for vote. Thank you so much, Barista, for joining us tonight on Talking Point.